Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to trace over a shape using the pen tool in Adobe Photoshop CC. I'm using this particular Batman logo because it allows us to go over a bunch of challenges here. We have um, curves, we have changing direction of curves, going back to straight lines and back to curves and again straight lines and so forth. So we have a lot of changes between curves uh, straight lines and changing directions. Uh, first and foremost we're going to head to layers panel and I'm going to reduce the opacity of this Batman logo. I'm bringing it to 30 percent and then I'm going to click on this lock icon to lock the layer. Alright, now we're going to head to the toolbar and pick up the pen tool or just simply press P Let's take a look at the options bar. I have the option shape. I'm selecting no fill and red stroke with four points so you can see it well. We can start from anywhere and um, basically you need to trace all around the image so it doesn't matter where you start you gotta always come back to the same place. I'm going to start from this top left corner. So click once to create the first point then I'm going to go here, click and drag. I'm happy with this curve, I'm going to let it go. Uh, obviously this is my third point, but see what happens. If I click and drag, it's going to go downward because the curve follows the handle. So this is what's going to happen. And I have no way of creating a good curvature here. So what I'm going to do instead, I'm going to press uh, or hold Alt or Option on Mac and click on the second anchor point. That will get rid of the handle. So now I have total control of this curve. So I can click in here, click and drag here, and that would be my new curve. I'm going to do the same thing. Hold on Alt or Option, click here once on the third anchor point. That handle goes away and we're going to continue this process. So once here, one more time, hold Alt click, once here, again get rid of that one and now we have a straight line obviously that's not a challenge so just one click creates a straight line. Alright so now we have a couple curves here so we have to break it down. I'm going to break it down up to here so let's click and drag Again, I would like to have total control of my curve, so I'm going to hold Alt and click here. Then this uh, particular place is quite challenging. I can actually break it down again, or I can experience just cl clicking and dragging. So let's see what happens. You see, if I click and drag, I'm not going to get a good curvature there. So I'm not going to be able to hit this one right. Instead, I'm going to break it down in two pieces. So click there and then click and drag up maybe do it, do it again click and drag up alright I'm happy with it um, these are straight lines so I'm just gonna click 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 and again uh, we have a choice of breaking this down to several pieces so I'm gonna click it and drag I'm not happy with this. I'm going to press Control Z or Command Z to undo it. I'm going to try it one more time. Okay. All right. It's much better. There you go. Click and drag. Uh, we're we're going to need to get rid of this anchor uh, handle. So I'm going to click hold hold Alt and click on the anchor point. And we're almost done. All I need is to click on the starting point to close the loop. So there you have it. And now we have a shape here. Um, and we can change the color of it. We can change the fill, stroke, or whatever you want to do. So that basically is how to trace a, a picture or a shape or a path using uh, the pen tool in Photoshop. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching.